Britannia, Britannia rules the waves. Britain never, never, never shall be slaves. Off the coast of Argentina, a island meant to be, with 1,800 people and a half a million sheep. The day they were invaded, everybody learned the name. A barren little colony had got a bit of fame. We stopped our ships full of British beer and bullets. Mobilised the navy and we called out the marines. We sailed two weeks till we reached the Falkland Islands, so we could teach a lesson to those bloody Argentines. Maggie Thatcher was awakened in the middle of the night. She heard the Argentinians was calling for a fight. She summoned up her cabinet and met with the MPs and sent the pride of Britain to the stormy southern seas. We stopped our ships full of British beer and bullets. We mobilised the navy and we called up the marines. We sailed two weeks till we reached the Falkland Islands, so we could teach a lesson to those bloody Argentines. Well, in came the Yanks, who had to have a say, so they sent Al Haig down when I saw his way. He shuffled to and fro, always managing to smile. The Yanks still refused to leave that barren British Isle. So we stopped our ships full of British beer and bullets. Mobilised the Navy and we called up the Marines. We sailed two weeks till we reached the Falkland Islands, so we could teach a lesson to those bloody Argentines. Well, the whole world watched as the British fleet drew near, and the battle for the Falklands was finally here. We sank their ships, brought down their aeroplanes, and took those cheeky archers off to mess with us again. We stopped our ships full of British beer and bullets, we mobilised the Navy and we called up the Marines. We sailed two weeks till we reached the Falkland Islands, so we could teach a lesson to those bloody Argentines. All the local girls were waiting when Prince Andy disembarked. He had a reputation that he liked to wear a lock. They covered him with kisses, they walked him in the grass. He said he never saw a better piece of British land. So we stopped our ships full of British beer and bullets. We mobilised the Navy and we called up the Marines. We sailed two 